Greetings. This rising video is about the importance of earthing and more importantly laying on the earth and finding a magnetic line, a ley line, a water main line as well, a plasma line basically, song line, dragon line. So you can use your pendulum and you can call it to you to that area of the earth that you're laying on, I'm hearing to remind you. But also you could use your pendulum to find where is a ley line for you to go ahead and lay down and receive an influx of plasma, an influx of centripetal megantropic movement of your essence into the natural vortex of your Taurus, but also to use the boost that the Mother Earth Gaia Sophia Tara grid can offer you. So is this, I've been coming to this spot for a few risings now, going on a couple strong weeks. Um, is this a good ley line for me? Is there a ley line right here? Did I call a ley line into right here? No. So it was, this is a ley line and because we're accessing the truth about non-location, about planes of existences, uh, coming in and out of phase, our, our, our master abilities, they're wanting me to share that, you know, you can facilitate your earthing experience, your laying down on the earth experience, wherever you are, and it's going to, there's all possibilities. So just remember, Everything is possible. If you feel like, well, I don't have the right place. Well, what can you do to tweak that area that you're about to lay down or sit down or, or stand on barefoot? Uh, what is that area calling for you to do? Clearing it, activating it, calling in uh, whatever sorts of balance and stability for that area so that it is, is a great area for you to go ahead and lay back on. Okay, so... I just got a really strong nudge to do this video several times. Let me make sure I'm giving you all the information. To do it in the rising setting, you know, preferably like sunset, sunrise is great because you're, there's a natural um, activation across the whole plane of existence, across all of the magnetic lines, nodal points that turns on naturally it's it's always on but there's a boost and i'm actually not in the rising you know it's it's so-called 10 a.m eastern standard time here but it's powerful i can feel my own longitudinal array expanded into the full consciousness that i am full bliss state that i am able to access in this now moment and i could smile and facilitate that I could put my hands on my thymus gland on the easy button and take some deep breaths up my central channel. I could do some sounding breath work, breath of fire to facilitate this. And I'm sitting up obviously and my bare bum is on, you know, I have pants on, <laughs> but I'm on the earth. Um, I do have shoes on at the moment. I'm, as I said that I felt like energy blaring out my feet. So I'm probably gonna take off my shoes so you can just sit here and it's going to be mucho beneficial <laughs> or like i said the biggest request that i'm hearing is for us to lay down on the earth so if you need a towel or a blanket if you're not if that doesn't really pay any um doesn't really bother you it doesn't really bother me then lay down if you have a you know team of light star system that you're working with that are also grounding in as trees you know, that's also great. I find these pine trees to be a great team of light that's working with um, what I'm doing here right now and the reason I keep coming back here to do some videos and do my practice. So I think that's complete. You can do the breath work, etc. when you're laying on the earth. And so I'm just going to go ahead and lay back. Um, I'm going to pop off my shoes. And is this clear? Is there anything else I need to do before I lay back? No. Okay. And here we go.
laying your palms on the earth is also great. smile and actually do breath work that accentuates your toric field and accentuates the extension of your field with your heart expanding into the bliss consciousness space at large smiling And you can communicate with consciousness during this time. You could ask for Arya, Mother Gaia, to give you a blessing and send her a blessing. You could ask your team of light trees to help. Good. So I got it complete just for this sharing. I'm probably gonna go back in. Please let me know how you do. Leave any comments, questions, and I look forward to us all tapping in and expanding longitudinal ray access into our own uh, aura. And most importantly, the retrieval of all memory and to know that you are here to access love for love. And as your light body turns on, it's just going to be amazing days ahead as you do this practice daily. So I'm excited to hear what you have to say. Have a great day.